pebbles. Oh, FIFA! Oh! Oh! Oh, FIFA! I was peacefully practicing my bowl tricks on my tech deck. Until all of a sudden, this sexist 14 year old male wanted a turn, so I dropped his ass. Over there, that's where the 775s are. No, I stayed in 825, man. Like, where are the 825s? <laughs> the 825s are over there. Right, that would be like $90, and I guess you want me to grip it because you don't know how to grip either. Bro, just give me the board. Like, I could probably grip it better than you. Here's your board. can probably tell the difference. These are wider than these. These are 29 millimeter. <laughs> it's about time, bro. And hey, there's a perfect Manny pad over there. Try and go hit it up. All right, let's get it. Get a head start, though. Dude, I'm at the skate park in Naples right now. Check this out. All right, look at this. It's got a little bowl right here. Nice street section with some down rails. It's got another street section with some rails, boxes, hips. And then this whole entire snake run slash bowl section. People are wondering how you film fingerboarding and get like slow motion clips. You come over here to your camera roll. You go over to slow-mo. I prefer to use the 120 because it's just higher quality. I have an iPhone 11 or 12. You can click on this little, uh, it'll say times five or something. And what it'll do is basically give you the effects of a fisheye. Speaking of fisheyes, you can pick these up pretty cheap on Amazon or at the dollar store. And they help getting uh, your clips in frame. Anyways, take your phone, flip it upside down to get a lower shot. Um, you can actually use the volume button to start recording and whatnot. And you just film for a little bit, whatever. You get your clip. Come over here, click on edit. And then you can choose what part of that clip you want to be in slow motion. By the way, I just used my dad's old iPhone 7 to film that. That's why the quality is really bad. 